Sorry, I'm back again. I'm back again because I just wanted to make. I just wanted to have a go at making that ram because I think he's so cute. He's so cute. But what I've done to save you all the boring bits because I know it takes a long time. Have you took your toy away? I've got all my bits here. And this was on um, just on the internet. It shows you. It shows you legs, body, wool, horns. There we go. Right. Let's have a. Let's see. Let's see if we can do it. So I've got. So we've got the. These are going to be the legs. So let just make sure they're all nice and soft. So I'm just going to attach, hello, hello, the little stumpy legs. And you can't, everything has to be a bit stumpy when you're making these clay models because, because it's not very stable otherwise. So I have never made this one before, so I don't really know what I'm doing, but I'm going to, take it that we're going to stick some legs on there so this is probably an easy one for you to start off if you want to do a, a standing up one so sort of for a bit more stability put the um, legs sort of together and I have no clue how these are going to go on here I'm just going to push them on just going to push them on. That actually looks more like a dinosaur, doesn't it, than a... It looks more like a dinosaur than a little sheep rammy type thing. But you've just got to imagine, imagine what it's going to look like. Right, so I've got my little, got my little figure. And these here, these balls here, I've got to stick all these on. And the reason I'm, I've rolled them all out, but I can feel they're still quite hard. Um, so I'm just rolling them in my fingers before I start sticking them on. And then, when we've stuck them all on, there's another little thing that you're going to have to do. And the right round, I don't think I've even got enough of you. The right round, round is bottom I've got some big ones there haven't I so you're just building him up you see how this is why he has to have stumpy legs because everything sort of gets pushed down a bit let's get oh. just put I'm do, trying to do it I'm rushing this so it doesn't take me long to do it but if I was just doing it watching telly, I'd probably make a better job doing it. But I just wanted to see how we'd turn out. So let's... Now, this is where I didn't really understand. See, his legs are squishing down a bit, but never mind. His legs are squishing down. Right. Maybe I should just lift him up while I'm doing it. I've got a funny feeling this is not going to be anywhere near what I think it's going to look like. It's the thought that counts. That's what you've got to tell yourself. Oh, I hope it turns out all right because I like, quite liked this one. It's got them little bobbly bits all over him. Can you see what I'm doing? Let me show them to you. Well, it's got all them bobbly bits just thrown on him. Thrown on for quickness. Because I know them other two videos I did were too long, weren't they? Bored you to tears. But I just wanted to... I'm going to need some more clay, I think. Make some more. I didn't. Hmm. He's not quite as. 
the right the shape I thought it was going to be. Let's put some more. Cut some of them in half. It's coming on, isn't it? Looks like a. I'm gonna say it. It looks like a constipated poo, doesn't it? It looks like a constipated poo. I hope we c I hope he's not gonna finish off looking like a constipated poo. That one does. That one doesn't look like a constipated poo. Why is mine? look like that now I thought I'd done enough balls for him right I'll just have to supple this up a bit let me have some of my bread is there anybody there so this is this is the sort of video that you just skip through to the good bits let me see how he's doing. And I didn't do enough balls. I didn't do enough balls. There his ears. And look massive, don't they? There his ears. Just this could not be any easier. I'm just a bit worried it's gonna look a bit rubbish. That's what I'm worried about. No point in me showing you how to make rubbish things, is there? Got to go out and do my errands in a minute. Got to go shopping, get some bits for the in-laws, isolated. And I've had enough of the news today. Oh, all year is everybody who's... Now you see, he's, his head's supposed to be up, not down. I think I'm going to have to give him some supportive balls under his chin. We all need a supportive ball now and again. Well, if I'd have known he was going to need this many balls, I would have rolled some more balls up. Hey, Teresa, it's just me and you, I think, Teresa. But it, I think I've got every faith that this bally, this probably, this ram, I cannot see how that, how's that proper shape for a ram? Oh, I'm a bit worried about this one, I've got to say. I should just abandon it now, shouldn't I? Because I don't even know if I'm going to have enough clay there because... He's not finished. He's, he's not even got any balls around his neck. I should just come back to you in a bit, shouldn't I? Right. Balls round his chin. And now he's gone all flat. And I actually, this idea I have, this idea I have of making them circles, I don't know whether it's going to work because the only thing that I could find... The only thing that I can find is the top of a makeup pencil. Right, you have that under your chin, mate. That's all I could find to make the little circles. We'll have to just let's just let's just stick with it. He hasn't. Oh, he has got a little tail. They do have little tails. I thought they had little tails. Oh dear, let's soap it goes. So, oh dear me. You're not looking good. What can we call him? I know what I'm going to call him. Hi Roz. I know what I'm going to call him. Raymond. Raymond Ram. Oh Raymond, I'm sorry darling. I'm not making you look your best, am I? Right, he is. Because we need to go eat. So all I've got is little discs that I've pushed, pressed my thumb into. I'm going to wiggle it over like that. Pinch it. Pinch it like that. Pinch it like that. 
and then I need to cut some off Raymond Raymond I'm sorry I will I'll love you forever I will love you forever now it's how you get these blinking well and just have a look see where he's now I can't get his see this is why you know on the bake-off when they when they say I've practiced this and then them ones you worry about them ones don't you when they say no it's the first time I've ever made it and he's oh where's his where's his thing he's gonna go right he's got some right let's just 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 hold it there just hold it there how's he looking now Raymond this is literally thrown together <laughs> I wonder if my um, I wonder if my husband would like a Raymond Brown for Christmas who wouldn't want a Raymond Brown for Christmas I just why does it why does it look so much better on paper than it does in real life right you know what I think now I think he needs some more I don't know how we're gonna do pushing them things in there because it's gonna squash it even more isn't it I think the trick is when you're sticking the balls on I think the trick is don't press them in that hard don't flatten them down because he looks properly flat I've got faith I've got some faith I've got my mate faith but I have got some faith we've got to have a bit of faith haven't we you've got to have, a, you've got to have faith, 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 faith right he's still standing he's still standing right I'm going to give him a little tail now so tail I'm not entirely sure. So that's gonna be his tail. I just gotta find a way to squidge it in somewhere. And I can't squidge it in because there's a ball in the way. Oh well. Right, that'll have to just that'll have to do, Raymond. So you can just push it in with some tools, but Oh my goodness. Can't tell his tail from his wool. Right. Right, 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 right. I'm going to give him some... I'm going to take the liberty of giving him some hooves. Right, Raymond. Stand nicely. You've got ears now. These things, I don't even know. I think that's... I think that's too big. I think those, are they called horns or antlers? Are they called horns or antlers? Right, I've got them, they're too big. Get rid of that. And then, you see, what you've got to understand is normally I would spend a lot more time and care making these. Can you see? Can you see him? Raymond, Raymond hasn't got a face yet, but I think it's in the detail. I think it's in them little circly bits. I think it's in them circly bits that it makes it look good. And these antlers look like the press the bit flat. I'm a bit worried it's just going to flop over because I think they'll be too heavy. Well, that's not the same size as that one. Remember when you push it down on your mat to push it back up to get it up with your knife. Get it up with your knife. Right, I have no clue. Right, do they start that way or that way? Never made this before. I've not made quite a lot of them before. I didn't make that. I haven't made that pick that peacock before either right let's start off with a flat edge oh my god this is so much harder than 
so much harder than it looks. Right, there he's got his... That's it, He'll, they'll have to just be squished on like that. So how do they go, like that? Oh dear. Do they have to be in a certain... Well, I don't know how on earth... Oh dear. Listen, if you haven't done this before, don't bother. If you haven't done this one before, don't bother. Because... It's really hard, this one. <laughs> oh dear! And I think I've done is... They're going to have to support each other, I'm afraid. He's going to have to have his horns, his horns or his antlers, whatever you call them. At this, do you know what? Some of these are really easy to make and this is not one of them. I don't think it's worth all this effort, if I'm honest. Right. I'm going to press down. Oh dear me. I thought he had. If you weren't watching now on here, I think I'd probably take these off and start do the horns again. But I am going to snip a bit off because they're too long and too heavy. Too long, too heavy, no good. And that's longer than that, so we can't have, we can't have him with unequal horns. Let's just make him a bit more pointy on the end. It's all right. It's not that bad, is it? I don't know how they go. They go like that. I don't know. Let's just stick with that. Some balls in between. He's got some balls in between. I'll show him you in a minute, but I think he needs cooking quite quickly because he's in dire danger of collapsing. I should have put some big balls in there, shouldn't I? Right, this is not going to work because they're too big. What can I use? What can I use for a circle? Use that. I can't believe I've not sworn yet. Right. You're just going to have to, I'm going to have to put this in the oven and hope it doesn't collapse. Anna. Oh, it looks really cute on the big journey. Right. Nearly done him now. Nearly done him. Let's hope that his. Come on, Claire. Come on. You can do this. They're proper floppy. See, the problem with my antlers is I'm not entirely sure that I should have flattened them down. Maybe I should have left them a bit more bit more bulky. That one's all right. I don't think they're supposed to be symmetrical, are they? They don't need to be symmetrical. They don't grow symmetrically, do they? Right, let me show you where he's up to now. So we've got him looking like that. And let me just put another couple of balls around there. Well, he needs a ball around there and a ball around there. And then we'll pop his face on. Oh, I've never made, I won't be making one again, I'll tell you that much. Won't be making one again, Raymond. One and only, Raymond. I'd love, do you know what? I am going to find where that's from. I'm going to put it on my page and 
anybody who can do one better than mine. I'll, I'll find something to give you something good. Right, there's his. Right. There's his eyes are going to be there and he's got a little, he's got a little nose and then he's got a little, a little, uh, hell. he's got a little mouth that goes down like that and then it's like a upside down V shape. Let me show you what I've done. A little upside down V shape and remember it's easier to press in your marks easier to press in your marks than it is um, first than it is to do it after you've stuck your nose on right Raymond oh <laughs> look how stumpy his legs have gone now because of all he's carrying a lot of weight our Raymond Need shearing, don't you, mate? Right, nose. So this nose is, it's more long and thin. We'll go with what's on the picture. But I've never had a long and thin nose on one of these things before. Let's see. Let's see. Oh, I think that's too big. That's far too big. Raymond, you don't want a complex D having a huge nose. You're already going to have a complex about your antlers or horns. Hey, Janet. Oh, dear. Do you know, this is the time of day that I look at the clock and go, I, seriously, is it one o'clock? Seriously. It's never one o'clock right that like that looks like more of a that looks like more of a decent sized nose Raymond right I would love I would love to see I might make him again I'll do this and go this is my first effort I might make him again take some care and attention over him Let's see how big his ears. He's, you, your horns are no good. Your horns are all over the shop. I think that'll make two eyes, not one. Right, Claire, you need to. You've got cooking to do today. Oh, I need to. I need to clean the house as well. And then, you know about what I was saying about. Um, I've always got six million years in my day, but I haven't really. I was going to make loads of dough models today and I'm still making FIMO ones but the thing is with um, the thing that I'm going to show you right so we will do some dough modeling tomorrow and I am not joking it is probably I would say a good good 15 years since I've done any um, dough modelling but the, the, the benefit of that so there's pros and cons to it the benefit of that is that you can make bigger things and it's really cheap because it's just flour and salt, I need some salt as well today, right where's my thing because this is going to work on some of them I know it is, no it's not it's too big it's too big Oh well, never mind. We'll just do it like that, like I was going to do it. But I haven't got anything to make a. I haven't got anything to make a little circle like they've got on theirs. I'll be I'll be ordering all kinds of modelling tools, won't I? See, so this is where you you end up with a. This is where you end up with a sheet like. Oh, there's somebody at the door. Dan, can you go to the door? Right, I'm going to go now anyway, because there's somebody banging on the door. Probably post postman. So I'm going to go now because you can see what it's like. But I will do you a picture of that little Raymond Ram. I'm going to sort his 
antlers out. And I'll see you again soon. Bye.